Here we gather at Dos Round Table to Battle of Knights. The Mech Knights versus whatever you're using, Mario. I'm gonna stop talking like that so I don't make everyone leave. It's a new knight comp deck I'm working on that's mixing together the original, the new support for the Arcana Knights, like Jack's Knight, Queen's Knight, along with Noble Knights. Ah, okay. So I remember a couple of those cards, but I'm excited to see what you got in for you. <gasps> Ooh, I already drew a first card that's in the new ban list. <laughs> Monster Reborn? Oh, yeah, man. Great first turn card, right? Oh, dude, okay. you literally put down a round table. I was just kidding. <laughs> Look at all these knights. All right, let's do it. Let's summon it's Merlin. It's round table, too. Woo. Yep. Sorry, robot knights are better. Merlin? Why have I never seen all this? You've never seen the noble knights. I guess not. Like, I've seen the, uh, I don't know, the jack and queen and whatever, but yeah. Never seen, like, literally the knights of the round table. That's cool. Parador coming on out. All right. And then their bread and butter, their equip cards. Oh, Excalibur's in this deck, isn't it? It is, actually. Oh, man. You know, I actually, when I was a kid, made three separate King Arthur parodies. It's great. One of them was for a class, got graded on it. It was awful. Got an A. <laughs> on that one assignment, at least, I had to drop the class. It was a little hard. Oh, shoot. That's right. Mech Knights. Two in a row. Uh-huh. It's alright, I, I have spell cards, so I could have just set something down to set you up anyway. Uh, ah, so it doesn't okay. actually make a difference here. But let's see what we got here. Well, let's, uh, I forget how to use all the spell cards appropriately, but let's start with the field card, get that World Legacy Scars out here. And I guess, very obviously, we're gonna want to start with Mech Knight of the Cobalt Depths. See, he's a knight, he just got, like, big circular blades, better than your little blue sword. And I'll activate his effect. So I can move him over a little bit. Thank you, thank you. And I suppose I want to do... No, nah, because I don't want to do this yet. Alright, what's this guy going to do? Well, yeah, that's a thing. And... <laughs> yeah, there's really not a lot of use in my hand right now. So I guess I'll just have to bring this guy out like so. His effect's not going to do anything because he messes with the graveyard though. Not the best opening first turn hand, considering I got three cards that require other things. But I got the damage. So what happens if I attack this guy? Nothing so far, but I do get to add in the equip spell that was equipped to him back to, to my your hand. hand. Not bad. Okay. So let's get a big chunk of damage out here. Now we're pretty sure that mech knights are going to have a slight advantage just because of, you know, how things are I... lately. Yeah, and not only that, I've barely made this deck like not even like 15 minutes yeah. ago but i haven't gotten around to making this uh mech knight deck more competitive though so you still got a chance um let's see i'm going to pop my effect because i might as well and i'll just move him over to here there we go nice new open slot hey life points too okay yep so who we got but here now gawain might as yeah might as well just have him crash Fair enough, so then I won't be able to summon something else in the same zone as well. Mm-hmm. That was a good call. Um, let's see. I'm not gonna- I don't I think I'm gonna be able to kill you here. Now I activate this effect. Which will allow me to send a Noble Knight's card to the grave. Okay. Because this is all adding up to the- to the number of Noble Knight cards I have in the grave for the field Ooh. spell. Oh yeah, let's see what this does. Six or more, you can special summon one from your hand. Then equip a- a uh, noble arms equip spell card from your hand to the monster. Well, I feel like that part's kind of easy. <laughs> um, send one from the deck to the graveyard. Yeah, sure, that just helps you stack it faster. Target a noble knight in the graveyard, add it to your hand. Not the worst. And draw a card. Yeah. So if this duel goes a while, that could help you out. Mm -hmm. right. Let's see. Ah, that's not going to help me a lot right here, so I guess... Yeah just going to uh yeah all i can really do is attack and i'm not going to be able to beat you no matter what i do so let's attack and not no point in activating my effect because there's no nothing on your field to work with so we'll just end it right there all right oh this is a good card i'll activate right. my reinforcements of the army hey that'll get him get out of your hand 
No. Cobalt Dutch, and you don't need to jump around right now. I'm actually going to add something that's not exactly at night, but is actually pretty good. Ooh, we got some pendulums in here. Yep. Sweet. All pretty right. Cool. I just have the one pendulum in here just for its pendulum effect. All right, let's see. You can discard one card. The opponent's battling monster attack and defense become half its current attack and defense. All right, so you got to discard for it, but it's a pretty good effect. I see you there. Mm -hmm. And I'll activate last chapter of the Noble Knights. Ah, yes, that was a good chapter. This allows me to special summon a Noble Knight from the grave. Okay. Along with a equip spell from the grave. <laughs> oh, I see you with your zoning. Then I'll special summon Gawain. Ooh, you got stuff. Mm hmm. Now, there's nothing left in your hand, so Empowered Warrior is not going to be able to pop his effect. Nope. But. Let's see. But. Nah, I'm not, I'm not ready for that effect yet. Oh. Okay. So, I'm going to go. Overlaying both of these. Yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> Alright. Good old Utopia. Ooh, just going into lightning. Okay. Haha, oh, you attacked me. I'm stronger than you. I'm obviously going to win this fight. 5,000. Yep. <laughs> Good old Utopia. And then I'll activate this, adding another Noble Knight to the grave. I'm gonna add my Ig Noble Knight. Okay. Let's see what I'm gonna do here then. So I got some moves. Uh, I'm going to... Yeah, I'm just gonna activate this card over here. And that's gonna be pretty huge with the play I'm considering here. I'm gonna move him over to... Yeah, I'm gonna select him and I'm gonna move him right here with his effect. Now, I wanna see if something works. Uh, first, let's just special summon this guy as well. And does he get to pop his effect once per turn when he declares an attack on an opponent's monster? Okay, so that's not going to happen. Um, but I think... Let's see. Let's try it. I'm going to fight you. Oh. oh, yeah, you didn't even have material. No, yeah, that's, why, like, that's why I normally like going into a... Like, uh, yeah, I was Utopia surprised Ray. you didn't have an additional Utopia in there. I ran out of space in my extra deck for it. Ooh. Oh, really? There must so be I a lot of important I... stuff in there. Yeah. Uh, okay. I guess that's that. I could have actually beat you this round, but I thought that was going to be uh, a little more revealing. I was going to key of the world legacy to counter your effect because you're in the same row as a Jackknight monster. Just for those of you oh, the who didn't Drake catch Odyssey's. what I was doing. Um, just the effect of key to the world legacy. And when an opponent's effect is activated in the same column as a Mech Knight monster um, that, you're, that you control resolves, uh, negate that effect. Hmm. Yep. Well, all I drew was my King's Knight. Not exactly helpful right now. Yeah, I guess not. Uh, let's see. One, Sorry. two, three, four, five, Why are we six, counting? Seven. Oh, no, I was just seeing how much I ended up. The, uh, yeah. I was hoping I was at 9 so I could activate Noble Knight of the Round. True. Yeah, I'm wondering if... <laughs> you're gonna hate me for saying this, but you know what would get cards to the graveyard really quickly? A Grinder Golem combo. <laughs> well, Grinder Golem's a bit nerfed now, so... And plus mm -hmm. you said you needed the extra deck space. Yeah. I will send this to the grave. Alright. That's just eight, though. Not enough. To... Yeah. Hey, I just drew my only Grinder Golem. Cool. Oh, well, did you? Yeah, rather than having people sit through that, let's just special summon another one of these guys. And I could do another one if I had another one in my hand, but instead, I'm going to fight you with one of your own monsters. Let's oh, who are you bringing back then? Who will do just enough? 2,000. Darn it. I don't think there's any 2,100s in there. No, oh. I got 2,000. <laughs> huh. Banish. If I control a light monster. No. Alright. We'll just get this guy back. Now it'll get you down to at least 100. 
Rawr. The Battle of Knights. Okay. So Jack Knights are really quick and powerful. But I see what your deck's all about. So if you can outlast me, you're going to have a pretty good chance here. Mm-hmm. So let's see. Which oh. knight shall be more fortuitous? I play Future Fusion. Hey. Okay. Future Fusion. You can run three of those now with the new ban list. Awesome. Yep. Are, are There's you two in the three? deck right now. Okay. <laughs> it's not best to oversaturate it. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, I see that. There's very few spell and trap cards that can, you know, really be ran three of them in most decks. And then let's just summon Artorias. All right. Thanks for lining me up. Uh, you, As you told me, it doesn't really matter since you have spell if cards. If I have spell or trap cards, which I certainly do right now, but I don't always. So, <laughs> let's see. What does this guy do again? I haven't played these guys in a while. Destroyed by battle. Ooh, if an opponent. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. That's going to be a good play. I know this one's a good choice, though. Let's see. Can I add? Yeah, I think I just want to stack myself up here. So, let us special summon this guy. <laughs> Mech Knight of the Blue Sky. And I will add to my hand. Where's the really good one? This one. And add to my hand. What else do I want? This one. Yeah. All right. Now that I got a nice hulking handful of cards... I can't exactly do anything else crazy, but I can World Legacy. Powering him up a bit. Yep. What do I do to activate this again? Well, it's per turn. I can discard one Mac Knight monster or one World Legacy card. Draw a card. Yeah, let's do it. I wonder what... <laughs> literally every card in my hand is available for this effect. So let's just do that. Simple enough. And yeah, of course, the other effect that's very rare that it'll happen. I think I'm just going to go for the attack now. That future fusion's potentially going to hurt me. And this card's not going to be any good just yet. Uh, yeah. Let's just go for it. All right, blue sky. Attack the Artigorus. Or Ar Artorigus. Artorigus. There. Sounds cooler when you say it like that. End my turn. Man, I like these cards. They're cool. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to reveal an Arcana Knight. Send Ooh. one of each to the grave. Oh, yeah. Future. Okay. Future Fusion is actually really good for this deck. Yeah. The graveyards, <laughs> too. Awesome. Unfortunately, those uh, Arcana Knights don't count. I mean, the Arcana Knights don't count for Noble Knights. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah, they have to be Noble Knights. Or okay. else you could just slap in any knight card that has a knight in the name. Yeah, that'd be nice. Oh, uh, imagine how sick that would be with uh, Mech Knights. I guess it wouldn't be, because yeah. these guys don't usually go to the graveyard too often, but... Yeah. I mean, you could make it but happen. I'm actually going to keep the card in the same column, because you so can can't utilize... Smart. Yeah, I was just thinking that. Uh, let's see, then. What can I do? I can't summon anything else because of that. I mean, I think I can normal summon anything I'm going to. Um... Actually, no, I don't think I am going to. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not going to work out too hot. Uh, no, I might as well, because I'll be able to bring out an additional Mech Knight. Two additional Mech Knights. Yes, I'm going to... Uh, nope, I am going to set this card here. I'm going to special summon Cobalt Depths. This is a really good one because I can just move it around and then summon another guy. And this will be the Lavender Dusk. And I think Lavender Dusk's effect is pretty sick. Let me just set a card. Uh, I guess over. It doesn't really matter where I set it, but I'll set it here. Because I got I got two other cards in case I need to do that later. Mm -hmm. um, actually, ooh, I still got one card to set here. Let me set this one over here. then. Just making sure filling up as much space as I can, actually. And, yes, I wanted to activate this. Or did I want to battle first? Uh, yeah, I guess I might as well battle first, because who knows what's about to happen. And, no, not activate. I want to attack the little face-down monster. Alright. So I get some life points in, but now we're about to see that fusion. Yep. The only bad thing about future fusion, it does take up your only fusion, your extra deck zone. Unless yeah, you already true. have a monster out. 
was hoping to have a link monster out by this point. Oh, yeah, true. Uh, let's see. Who do I want to add here? Uh, just in case that thing's scary, I'll grab a uh, Crimson Lotus. Uh, he's the one who can just straight up destroy things. Uh, let's see. Main phase two. I could summon Crimson Lotus right now, but I want to save that capability. Ooh, but right now is the only chance I could summon him using that future fusion card because it's about to go away. Or is it? I don't know. I don't know how Wigo Pro works. Some of the cards that are supposed to go away just stick there. No, no, it does. It becomes an equip, so it becomes like called the haunted. Oh, yeah, yeah. So this one just stays there, yeah. The thing is called the haunted always just stays there when the card, even after the monster dies. Yeah, that's a tough card. And okay. let's summon you out. And equip Excalibur. Oh, that sounds cool. Uh, yes, I absolutely want these columns right here. Do not switch anything around, Mech Knight. <laughs> you got this. Uh, Excalibur. It's what is actually more. It's actually the sort of legend, not Excalibur. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's have Joker destroy the Cobalt Deaths. Ah, oh, darn it! No effects. Her. Huh. Let's see. Yeah. What is your effect on that guy? Once per turn, oh. when a spell, a trap card is affected, you can discard the. Her. Huh. I see. Okay, I get it. So that's gonna hurt. And let's see what your face down is. Ha ha, I have defense points! Da 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 da! Oh, that is high defense points. No wonder yeah. you put them in. <laughs> exactly. Why not? Because I didn't even special summon him, so you know. Oh man, another another table. It's just to add more Noble Knight cards to the grave. Yeah, because the, the field card counts. That's smart. Yeah. I like it. Let's All end right. the turn. Cool. I think I got some. And now that I have enough in the grave in the field, yeah, I can gonna start send sending. An mm -hmm. And you can do that every turn, so that's exponential right there. Very good. Do any of them have any bonus effects when they're sent to the grave? Uh, Ignoble Knight does. Okay. I can send uh, a face up light mo normal monster I control to the grave, Let's and I can special summon this from the hand or, hand or grave. Nice. Uh, let's see. Might as well put you here. Activate. So I can put you over. Actually, I could summon everything in my hand, technically. It's just I need to find a way to beat that Joker. So I'm not going to burn everything I have until I know what I'm doing. So let's do that. Actually, this could probably beat the Joker. Huh. Oh, maybe. Oh, you have to discard to use your effect. Darn it. I was trying to figure out a way to bait you, but clearly that's not happening. No. All right, so I'm going to activate this. And I will banish the Mech Knight of Blue Sky. And, uh-oh. Couldn't target your Joker. Fun. Oh, I think it's the, uh... Hold on, is it Excalibur that's preventing you? Hold maybe. On. Cripple, uh, cannot be targeted by opponent's card effects. Oh, yeah, I didn't even click that you put Excalibur on the uh, Joker. I thought it was on the guy right next to him. It that is. That is cool. That is cool. No, 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 it is a quick oh. to... Huh. Well. Oh, I think it might be in... I think it's... Huh. I don't know why you can target Arcane and Night Joker. Hmm. There's something on the field we're not picking up. You still key. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let's see. What can I do here? Well, I want us to card declares an attack on the opponent's monster. I can target. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so I will blow my whole hand because, yeah, monsters. And let's uh, go for an attack here. I know exactly who's making the attack. It's less damage, but I get to pop the secondary effect. So let's do it. Ooh, but you get a secondary effect. Oh, yeah, just bring that to the hand. Yep. Okay, so let's see. Let's go to main phase two, because I cannot beat you otherwise. And how do I even pop this guy? Let's see. When this card declares an attack on opponent's monster. Oh, in the same column. Okay, so that would have been hard to swap him around, actually. It's fine. Let's see. So main phase two. Let's activate this guy. And send away. Uh, Yeah, I guess just himself again. Why not? And add to my hand. Huh. So I can't target your dude. And we don't know why. 
Huh. I guess. Uh, I need to get more Jack Knights in my hand. I'll get the uh, Mech Knight of Blue Sky. And with that, I suppose I should go into a uh, Link Monster. Because it's going to... No, it's not even going to be enough. Yeah, I'll just wait it out. I'll wait you out. And, right. you know, I'm running out of time. But yeah, I should have oh. been going into my Link Monster earlier that time. Merlin. Merlin has come back. Welcome, Merlin. Sending him to the grave. Okay, let's see. I can pop this card special summon a monster uh, i mean sure let's uh get this guy because he has a cool axe <laughs> not very knightly to use an axe though yeah it is and i cancel your effect oh you do yeah uh true depths of world legacy when you're in the same column as a jack or a mech knight i'm gonna call them jack knights for a while since they changed the name um yeah i get to cancel your effect that's what i was trying to bait your um knight joker into earlier but obviously you didn't need it you just have attack points on me yeah um, i might as well just kill your lotus oh yeah we'll see about that oh he's over here now <laughs> yeah <laughs> I, know. I just like to imagine you try to move him behind me and then he did the whole <laughs> over here <laughs> Yeah, and then you just stab behind him. Yeah, pretty nice much. <laughs> Let's see. How do I get rid of this guy if I can't target him? I mean, is it... So what is it? Why can't I, I don't get him? I don't know. <laughs> oh, no. Maybe it's just something dumb I did. I don't know. Maybe. It could honestly be that. Be that. <laughs> or well, first of all, let's bring our boy back over here. Um... I guess I'll bring him back in this column. Yeah, I definitely need to consider bringing out my big guy, my world scar. World scar! Sorry. <laughs> um, let's see. Da, da, da. Oh, that's why. What you couldn't it? target him. You're, you have to target a monster within the same column of Crimson Lotus. He wasn't in the same column. Of column oh, ah, okay, yeah. That's what I he was in. Do. He was in a direct middle. None mm -hmm. of my cards were in the middle. Okay, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Very good. So I was just dumb. Perfect. All right, what do I actually want to do here? I guess we'll go all world scar on you. Uh, do, 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 do. And what do you do again? It cannot attack directly. If the scar is in the extra deck, it does not point to a monster. It cannot be destroyed by card effects. Also, if your opponent cannot target this with card effects. Yeah, you don't need card effects right now. You can send one other card to control and give you a special summon one Mac Knight monster from me. So I can send one other card I control in the cards column to the graveyard. Okay. So, I will, uh, you know what? This is actually going to come in hand handy, so let's put that here. Let's put this here. And let's activate. Send this to the grid. And what do I get with that? <laughs> Special summon a Mech Knight monster from my deck in preference. Yes! Sweet. I'm not worrying about you yet. I will summon you right here. Now, let's try it. <laughs> Select a card to banish your twin. I did it! Dang it, if I had a monster in my hand, I would have actually been able to cr cancel out your effect. <laughs> yeah, I know. Um, cool. So now, I've done that. That guy's looking sick. Uh, I really want to summon this guy, but I can't really. Hey, this guy can use it again. I can destroy himself if I want to. Um, but instead, let's just go for the attacks, because we have enough points to finish this game off. I oh. really need to work on this deck, but you can see where it's going. Yeah. Want to do one more just to see if anything magic happens? Uh, we should probably move on because we have other things we need to take care of. <laughs> fine. That's fine. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Knights versus Knights. I can't wait to see that, that, that deck. I want to find a deck that that one's nice and balanced against and fight it again. Because that's that, that or I need fun. to just make this or I just need to make this deck better because there's a lot of things I could do to make I it better. Mean, I don't know if it's gonna fight with mech knights because mech knights are super fast and you want to stay on. Oh, the... there's a I was combining with a different archetype, but a noble knight on its own can shut down because of a link monster. Well, maybe we'll be able to see some of that soon. But if you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a pinky on that like button. Of course, comment down below any other duels you want to see regarding either of these decks, and we will see you guys next time.